Hello everyone, uh, today we're going to uh, discuss another subject of debunking anti-communist. With that, I'll leave the subject to my grandson Tristan. Go ahead, Tristan. All right, thank you. So today, specifically, I wanted to address the arguments against communism that basically goes like this. Essentially, the argument is that employers in a capitalist society should be able to exploit and extract the surplus value produced by the ones the workers that they employ because they're they are the ones that employ that uh, provided the opportunity for employment now the big flaw in this argument for me is that it doesn't refute necessarily the view that exploitation and extraction of surplus value takes place within capitalist society it just says that this exploitation is okay because it's normal and a function of capitalist society which if you kind of reword it to fit this view then you know obviously the argument becomes very incoherent it's basically saying exploitation is fine because it's normal within the society because that society in question that you're living in enables exploitation, which is obviously very incoherent and not and not an argument at all. It's in fact kind of a, it's kind of fuel for communists saying that you know we should abolish the system, we should abolish capitalist society because it necessarily functions on exploitation. It's ironically kind of an argument for communism and not against communism, specifically because it doesn't refute the view that extraction of surplus value and exploitation does happen within communist society. So yeah, that would pretty much wrap up the subject, wrap up the video. I know it was pretty short, but you know, this argument is pretty dumb, so you know. It's uh, pretty much answering one of the uh, viewers. Yeah, the argument's pretty dumb, so it doesn't take too much to refute it, take it down. Anyway, that would pretty much wrap it up. Thank you for watching, and we will see you next time. Thank you.